my hood. Ready to go. Let's do a safety brief, passenger briefing. Passenger briefing. Okay, our seat belts are worn at all time. You have the silver buckle here, put that in, pull the straps down to your waist and pull down on the other strap to tighten them up. Okay, uh, emergency exits are the primary doors here. Uh, are the only doors. Uh, the vexal axle will be back away from the propeller at all times. And Uh, if the chute was deployed, uh, avoid any of the cables and lines. Uh, if, if the uh, doors are blocked, there's a hammer here in the center console. Smash the window, get it loose, and smash it out with your shoulder or feet. Let me know smoking or drinking. Uh, the control vents, you have these eyeballs here. Point them yourself, twist them to open and close. The controls are up in the uh, co-pilot's section right here. Uh, please uh, be on the lookout for other aircraft in our vicinity. Uh, speak up when you see something. Uh, if there's a fire, there's a fire extinguisher on my, by my left foot. Unclamp it and point at the base of the fire. Uh, if the fire is on the pilot side, the co-pilot will manage the controls. If he's unable, we'll do it, go straight and level on the autopilot. Uh, if it's on the co-pilot side, co-pilot will fight the flames and pilot will manage the aircraft. Uh, if you're feeling uh, caps, caps handles here, pull it down to engage and pull straight down hard to deploy it. Uh, if you're feeling uh, sick or nauseous, please speak up, let us know, look into the distance, open air vents, and if needed, we will land as soon as possible. Solid. Okay. Solida, 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 Nina, porque esto es español. Solida, solida, <laughs> solida. I could be a star if I go there. You are a star, man. Touch ground to Skyland 8701 with Romeo requesting uh, uh, two nine left. Skyland 8701 X ray, Torrance ground, two nine left, tag via Alpha Golf. Alpha Golf for two nine left, zero one X ray. King Air. Man, I see Rick every time I see two engines on a plane. <laughs> Towards ground, Sears Niner 66 Tango Tango East T's requesting uh, taxi to fuel dock. Sears Niner 66 Tango Tango Towards ground, taxi fuel via uh, Alpha Echo. Alpha Echo fuel, uh, 6 Tango Tango. Clear right. Clear right, clear left. Welcome aboard, everyone. All of our loyal viewers. And flyers. And flyers, those who join us virtually. Virtually. We are virtually here. Yeah, they don't have to be in the heat. Oh, but it's so nice to be in a Schwitz. <laughs> in a Schwitz. <laughs> Where'd you learn that word? Uh, come on, man, I lived in New York. In a Schmitz. It's nice to be in a Schmitz. Oh. People pay to be in a Schmitz. Here we have a free Schmitz. That's true. <clears throat> free Schmitz. We should charge people to sit in the back and have a free Schmitz. A free Schmitz ride. Oh, could you imagine? Free Schmitz ride. <laughs> uh, six zero your uniform. That could be Ray. That's true. Ray. Ray. Are you a Corvette man? Yeah, that's. Uh, I mean, the new ones are technologically interesting, um, but at my stage, whatever that means, it's kind of like a, a midlife crisis kind of car. Yeah. Um, but cool, I mean, I, was, I did, had watched the uh, review that um, Jay Leno did, he's a big car uh -huh. guy, you know, and the, like, their high-end one is freaking amazing. Really? It's like it's, you can almost just put it on a track. 
It's just it's a really cool car. Yeah. So I wouldn't mind having one, but Corvette. You know, if I was going to go to a car like that, I would just get a Roma. Get a Roma. Let's get a little Roma going on. Roma. Roma. Clear right. Clear left. Clear right. Clear left. Outwest aircraft. Out. Outwest. Actually, Outwest is not a bad name. Outwest. Outwest aircraft service is pretty good. Outwest. Let's see. Do I have the wingspan to be right on the line? No, uh, not really. Yeah, maybe. So so. So so. So so. So so. Shalom Alechem. Malachi Asharet, Malachi Elion, Min Melech, Malachi Hamelachim, Hakadosh Baruchu. Don't do that till I start the airplane. <laughs> Headset after you start the airplane, so you can hear what the airplane's doing. Shalom Alechem, Malachi Asharet. Did your instructor teach you properly? My instructor? No. <laughs> okay, that guy there. Oh, that air feels good. That air feels good. Alternatas? Alternata? Boom, boom. Bam. Bam. Ba boom. Solid. Fuel full. Full. Full fuel. You're full of it. Topped off. Time's ground. Cessna 21 Sierra Zula, you uh, exit Delta for South Bay. That's 21 Sierra Zula, Torrance Ground, Texas, South Bay via Delta. Via Delta, South Bay, 21 Sierra Zula. Absolutely solid. Perfection. I can see that guy pull it behind us. Uh, perfection. Perfection. for multiple cranes in the vicinity of Torrance Airport. Check notes for more information. North path for helicopters is currently closed for construction. Torrance Tower frequency 133.07. Use caution for bird activity on the vicinity of the airport. Use caution for work in progress adjacent all runways and taxiways. Has this weather information for California and Coastal Oswego on flight service frequencies. All the aircraft readback hold short instruction and runway sign with call sign. Advisor contact you with Aedis Romeo. Romeo. Torrance Airport, aid information, Romeo, 1847 Zulu weather, wind calm, visibility 10 miles, sky clear, temperature 37, dew point minus 3, altimeter 2994, approaching you, SILS runway 29 right, landing departing runway 29. Landing and departing runway 29 right. Okay, we'll do it later. 
and the altimeter has to be within 75 feet of field elevation. So you're flirting with the edge. Look at that, if that's 299 or 4. You can calibrate it maybe sometime. Orange ground, this is Cessna 5047 Lima student pilot off of Echo, runway 29 left, requesting good. taxi back to 29 or right. Okay, uh, so what's the call sign? So let's go ahead and do this. Cessna 5047 Lima. Cessna 47 Lima, Torrance ground, 29 right, taxi via Alpha Juliet. Taxi via Alpha Juliet, 5047 Lima. Activate it. You could activate it, yeah, easy. You could activate it a million times. All you're doing is you're sequencing straight from here to Seal Beach, and then it sequences you into the approach. Now you want to hit highlight, scroll down to the hold, and do direct activate. Make sense? Good. And what this just did is once you go to Seal Beach, which you otherwise anyway would do with the activate approach, the next sequence will be to keep you in the hold and not take you towards the procedure turn. Does that make sense? It's all a question of what will your GPS activate next once you hit your next waypoint. Good, good, good. Solid. Terrence Grounds, F9433, Fox Romeo is clear of 29 right at uh, Charlie, taxi for pay. 4433, Fox Romeo, taxi Charlie, ramp. Ramp via Charlie, 3 Fox Romeo. Alright, so this is. There's my active. Okay, and we're doing the. Doing the VOR Alpha into Fullerton. Our charts are valid. Our uh, approach frequency is 115.7, uh, which we will uh, tune and identify as soon as we can. Our ATIS is 12505, which we'll listen to as soon as we can. Uh, can't get it here, can we? No. Okay. Uh, tower. 119.1 and ground 121.8. Uh, we're going to be coming out of the Seal Beach hold. We will fly outbound, make our procedure turn to the left, procedure turn back into the right, and get established on the approach course uh, of 020, which will also be a radial once we pass Seal Beach. Um, one mile from Seal Beach will be 100 knots and flaps 50. Uh, as we come out of the procedure turn, uh, we want to be no lower than 2,600. Once we pass Seal Beach, uh, we can begin our descent to 1,500 to B Walt. At B Walt, we can begin our descent to today. Our um, MDA is uh, 1,100, which is traffic pattern altitude. Uh, we will level out after 1,200. We'll go no hood, and we will. Um, Look for the airport, sight the airport, and begin whatever uh, landing direction we were given from tower. Uh, Front ground, November 5013, Romeo is on the back. We will right circle at Charlie, and request taxi instructions for transit parking. November 5, Why will you take your hood off? Charlie, Alpha, Echo. At 1200. Because I'll be popping Charlie, Alpha, 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 Echo for one Why will you not descend below 1100? Because then uh, I'm below my MDA squared. and I have to go mist. Cool. What's the mist approach procedure if we have to do that? It is. Climbing right turn. Uh, to 2600, heading 145. To the Seal Beach yeah, radial yeah. 058, and then hold at Seal uh, Beach. Cool. Plant goal when will this is going from KPOA to Kilo turn? 
when will the suspend button show up on your GPS in the event that you do need to go hold uh, missed? Uh, when and if I reach my MDA, I uh, missed approach point. Which is? Which is Judd Low. Good. So if we went missed prior to reaching Judd Low, will your suspend button show up or not? No. So what will you do if you need to go missed and you do indeed want to sequence your GPS to hold your hand and take you there? Uh, then I would do. Um, go procedure. No, we just go flight plan, uh, highlight the hold. Good, and then, and then do direct, what? Direct enter. Does that make sense? Yeah. Good. So it's a little more workload, a few extra buttons to hit, but it beats our CDI representing Judlo, right? Which we haven't yet touched. Make sense? Good, good, good learning. Solid. Good. Oh, and if and when I go missed, I turn the autopilot off. Yes, you throw the yeah. automation away, but right. we won't have it on today. Right. Cool. Good work. Okay. I think we're ready. You could go missed with autopilot in general. If you do suspend, if if you if you do suspend, guess what? If your autopilot's following your GPS, right. now your needle represents the missed approach procedure. Right. But, but today we won't have the autopilot. And procedurally, as far as like check right stuff, you go missed, you throw the automation out, period. Not, not necessarily. Really? Absolutely not. The only time we said we throw the automation away is when we pop out of the clouds on approach into a runway right. following a instrument approach. So automation then, away, flaps 100 and land. So we go miss before we hit our MDA, before suspend is there, flight plan, highlight, uh, hold, direct, direct enter. enter. And then and we can stay, fly on, to we stay on GPS. Correct. Correct. Because remember, our bearing pointer should be up the entire time. Right. So now I do have a localizer here. A uh, localizer? No, I mean, I have a uh, VOR uh -huh. that we're flying this on, so I can do this. Yeah, that's what we want, because we need something speaking the VOR's language past the final approach fix inbound. So just have it up the whole time, and it's that green turquoise arrow which points to the station. So when you're done with your procedure turn, you're flying towards Seal Beach, the arrow should point where? Uh, towards Seal Beach. Right, I straight mean, toward, up. Yeah, straight up. Once we cross Seal Beach inbound, the arrow should flip and point what? Straight back. back. Right. Make sense? Yeah. If the arrow throughout the entire final approach course starts pointing any right or left rather than straight back, that's telling you that you're veering off that radial or that final approach course. Make sense? Yep. Good. Easy work. Absolutely solid. All right. <clears throat> Torrance ground, Cirrus 9 or 6, 6 Tango Tango at uh, the fuel dock. Uh, looking for a taxi to 2 9 right with Romeo. Echo Alpha Juliet, 2 9 right, 6 Tango Tango. 6 Tango Tango, welcome everyone on board. Let's do our taxi instrument checks. Okay, so our uh, HSI turns left when we turn right. Our ball and our brick go opposite of the turn right now. Uh, our attitude indicator has come up and is level within five minutes. Clear left, clear right. Clear right. Our magnetic compass is uh, flowing, is moving freely, has no bubbles, no cracks. And uh, that is it for Mr. Taxi Check. Absolutely solid. Ooh, gee. Good stuff. Imagine Phoenix flight training in the middle of the summer with no AC. Uh, I don't even want to. I've done some here. I mean, obviously, Southern California can get a little toasty. Man. Uh, in our little Cessnas. But, uh, yeah. Crazy. I haven't. I have uh, landed several times in the desert at 110 degrees. Oh, boy. And you're like, oh, it's not so bad. And then you you start to taxi, and you're like, oh, yeah. oh my God, I'm dying. Yeah. And I'm like, when I get an airplane, it's going to have air conditioning. Yeah. <laughs> I used to do a bunch of flying out of Phoenix in the summer. Lots of IFR flying. And cross-country IFRs used to go up to, it was fine, because it was burning on the ground, but we used to file and fly at, you know, 10, 11,000. And it was nice and cool up there. You opened the vents, and it was just great air conditioning air. And then it was always one of those things where we just hated top of descent. We hated descending because we were descending into this fire. Um, but up at altitude, it was great. Yeah. Not too bad.
Not too bad. Yeah, so you got the canopy open, but now you have the wind, the uh, sun beating down on you. Yeah. Well, but at least he can open the canopy. It's like you're convertible. Right. You know what I mean? At least but it's a convertible sitting still. Yeah. <laughs> it's a convertible sitting still. It's still then just a, a. But you know what? He gets the prop wash. She gets lounge. the prop. Oh, it's true. Yeah, it's like a big fan. Yeah. Because we'll do yeah, some unusual flight attitudes. Yeah. Uh, but if, again, if he tells you on the ride, hey, let's pick a flight following, call ground, flight following to Fullerton, uh, and that's it. How come this isn't turning? Because it's already all the way to the left. Oh, okay. And the uh, bug is up to the left. Check. Two, three, four. Going ground, 7734, tank uniform, Adam Carter, at Delta, two nine on right with its radio. 7734, single uniform, Torrance, ground, Roger, runway, two nine on right, taxi via Delta Alpha Juliet. 40. Taxi via Delta Alpha Juliet, two nine on right, 7734, tank uniform. Why is your manifold pressure increasing as you isolate the magnetos? Because the air that I'm bringing in is creating pressure in the venere valve. Venturi. Are you bringing in more air? You're not touching the throttle valve. Uh, the uh, RPMs of the engine are driving more air. So if there's more air, the pressure should be lower, then your manifold pressure should drop. Why is it increasing? Because we said as the fluid increases in velocity, its internal pressure right, decreases. Ground. If you isolate uh, a mag, your manifold pressure back, increases. Back, right, 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 so you, you have you have a valve in there. It's called the Venturi valve. So it's trying to force all the air through this small opening. Yeah, right, uh, what do you mean a Venturi valve? Well, there's a there's a there's a valve. In, there's there's a, the intake there's manifold. A, right, and so it, it goes into a smaller smaller hole. comes comes in through the intake. Are you thinking of carbureted engines? No, I'm trying to think of the air has to come in and it comes in. It doesn't just come in all in, and stay in one. One right, so the pressure, as it comes in, it goes into a narrower thing, and, and the pressure increases. So the pressure has to do with how much air we're letting through the valve and how much suction the cylinders are producing. What do you think it produces more combustion, a.k.a. suction, with the cylinders? Two working mags or one? Two. Two. So when you take one away, guess what? Is there more or less suction? Less. Less suction. So if there's less suction, meaning the air is moving less fast, what happens to its internal pressure? Goes up. Goes up, and that's why you see an increase in your manifold pressure. Make sense? Kind of. Good. It's a good start. Yeah, I mean, it, it, good. obviously. It, it all has to do with suction. The manifold pressure, essentially, is not a direct, but it's an indirect way to, to measure suction in the manifold, the intake manifold. It's a backwards way. More velocity, more suction, lower pressure. So because we isolate a mag, the cylinders are kicking less, there's less suction. 
Okay, so Colonel pressure in. goes up, you have an increased amount of pressure. Get information, Romeo. We have information, Romeo, okay. it's free. Controls are free and correct. Good. Okay. All right. Um, no, that's it. So let's go tower. Was that pulled out? I think it was pressed in. Check. Check, check, check. Check two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, four. eleven, twelve. Four and five, six, nine, six, five, Dima Bravo, hold your shirt to the right for bike close traffic. Okay, so I'm going to Bravo, take off tower, down wind, take off the latitudes, going to tune and Identify Seal Beach, and then we'll go to the hold. Yep, let's do a takeoff briefing. Okay, uh, if during takeoff we encounter an issue and we're, we have not rotated, we'll just stop the airplane. If uh, we have rotated and there's runway left, we will run land on the runway. If we rotate and there's no runway left, then we'll land straight out with no steep turns. Uh, if we land and, and we're between uh, we're less than 703 feet MSL, then we will try and land, either find a place to land or land back on the airport. Um, if we are between 700 feet, 703 feet MSL and 2100 feet MSL, we will pull caps immediately. If we're above 2100 feet MSL, we will troubleshoot, try and what's going on. If we drift below 2103 MSL, we will pull caps immediately. So, all right. Solid. Uh, Here we go. And five seven five going in. Five seven five, Roger. Follow the sling that's in the upwind. Okay, behind the twin, uh, five seven five. Let's go missed. It should be up there. Towards tower, Sierra Snyder, 6 6 Tango Tango, holding short runway 2 9 right, looking for downwind departure, right downwind departure, 6 Tango Tango. November 6 Tango Tango, Torrance Tower, Roger, stand by and say again, full call sign. Sierra uh, uh, Snyder, uh, November 9 or 6 6 Tango Tango. November 9 or 6 6 Tango Tango, Roger. 9 or 6 6. Tango November. Tango. Number five, Lima Bravo, extend downwind. Screen looks so extend downwind, five, Lima Bravo. Dark, scroll, uh, swipe with your finger at top right, down. Yep, and now pick up that light to the top. Number there five, seven, go. five, contact SoCal departure, and 27.2. 27.2, 575. It's very hot. Interesting. It might be the thing. Yeah, these things, the heat kills these devices. Oh, here it goes. Devuses. Devasses. Boost on. Full tank fullest. Mixture rich. Flaps 50. Off recirc. Lights on. Trim set for takeoff. Solid. Did you ever fly a carburet, Bravo, carbureted uh, engine right, airplane? Touch and go. I think the uh, the regular first tango five some of the road. slings are. Nine or six six tango tango Torrance Tower on way two nine right cleared for takeoff. Say again your departure. Uh, two nine right for clear for takeoff right downwind departure six tango tango. Or six tango tango Roger. All right, finals clear. All right. Four star five Lima Bravo on the go. Can I make a left track here for a final left? Number five Lima Bravo, after your touch and go, fly runway heading. Runway heading after touch and go, fly the runway. Oh, coyote on the runway. Oh. At Torrance Tower, just a heads up, but two nine are right. There's a coyote right to our left right now. Six Tango Tango. Number six Tango Tango, Roger. <clears throat> How do they get in here? Right? Man. We've got to jump over. Caution for reported coyote 
just past the landing threshold, the runway uh, on the numbers, uh, south of 29 right. Number 575, frequency change proof. Tower 724 Tango Uniform, holding short, right, 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 Caps the veil. All right, now let's go to map. Good. Four tower, swing, one six nine, tango with you over Angel Gate, inbound, nine right. Requesting touch with information, Quebec. Uh, Swing 16 Tower, make straight in runway 29 right. Straight in, 29 right, 9 Tango Whiskey. Number 5 Tango Whiskey, extend downwind. Uh, extending downwind, 5 Tango Whiskey. 9 Tango Whiskey. Number 7 is Tango Uniform, make right close traffic, follow the swing upwind, or correction, uh, just make right close traffic. Swing's going to be for the uh, parallel runway, runway 29 right, clear for takeoff. Take off, 14, 14, 14. Five Tango Whiskey, base turn through runway 200 right, clear for the option. Five Tango Whiskey, clear for the option for 200 right. Fireplane? Aeroplane. Fireplane. Swing 5 Lima Bravo, contact South Tower 124.0. 124.0, Fly Lima Bravo. Contact South Tower, Slinky 610 Lima, holding short of 200 right for a right 270. Uh, uh, Archer. Uh, your airplane? My airplane. Your airplane. I want you to keep doing what you're doing, but close your eyes. I'm ready, 241, Sierra Lima, Torrance Tower. No, not delay, runway 200 right, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff without delay, 200 right, 261, Sierra Lima. Keep doing what we were doing. Just, Just with the eyes closed. Change for we can change for six and a <coughs> Number 9 Tango Whiskey, number 2 following company traffic, 1 mile final, runway 29 right, clear touch and go, make right close traffic. Number 2, 29 right, clear touch and go, 9 Tango Good recover. Whoa, shit. I did not feel that at all. <laughs> Holy moly. Ah, don't trust your senses. Wow. <laughs> That's creepy. Isn't that insane? I kept hearing that, like, I, I don't feel like my, my speed Talk didn't change much, my climb didn't change much. Right. Yankee, but, uh, man. Right That's you. crazy. For Good. Right Hopefully that really shows you. You gotta keep your eyes on that in the clouds. Yeah. Can't trust anything. Good work. Let's get ourselves towards Seal Beach. Torn, so how would we do it? Direct enter enter. That's it. Torn, tower, Pink plane, line from the Seal Beach. Yankee, Good. There's 35. Let's level up. Right, uh, Julia, we'll go to Seal Beach. Uh, request right 270 departure. Swing 134 Yankee Torn Tower. Roger. Stand by. Custom 4 Tango Uniform number 2 following swing 2 mile final runway 2 on right clear touch and go. Good, now that we're on our way to Seal Beach, whenever you get a chance, I want you to go to close your eyes and keep doing what we're doing, just like we did before. Whenever you're ready. Swing 164 Yankee. And let me know Make when your eyes are departure runway 2 on right clear for takeoff. Okay. Clear for takeoff 2 on right, 6 4 Yankee. Eyes closed? All right, eyes closed. Cool. 
Take us to Seal Beach with your eyes closed. With your eyes closed. Good work. Keep your eyes closed until I say recover. And do your very best using your senses <laughs> to take us to Seal Beach. Number 410 uniform, turn back. Uh, what are you doing? I'll just switch for you. It's easier. Third ILS 3072 and Victor. Uh, SoCal system 5190 Juliet, uh, we have our climb 1500. We'd like to get a practice approach and uh, do a John Wayne if possible. So 5190 Juliet, so I got a part two, Roger. Uh, Stand by, I don't, I don't think they're doing approach right now. It's pretty busy over there. No problem, Sergeant Juliet. Juliet, so Cal Justina, 2016, or from going mess from Fort Chang, we'd like to hold over the Sylvia Tree of our, um, always set up for Long Beach. Good, keep doing what you're doing. Eyes closed. November 5199 Juliet, uh, uh, unable to uh, practice approach to uh, John Wayne, they're pretty busy, and uh, verify you're about a mile north at Disneyland. Yeah, we're by Disneyland, and uh, we understand no practice approach. Uh, we'll just probably just do a full stop at uh, John Wayne, go to Clay Lacey, there, Juliet. 99 Juliet, give me a standard, don't look. Park, altitude, discretion, radar contact. Do you look? Thank you yes. so much, Sergeant Juliet. Just keep your eyes closed. All right. Give me a standard rate turn to the right. Oh, to the right. Yeah. That'd be my other right. The other right, no, the first right. Good, now wings level. Standard right turn to the left. Cover. Uh, it was almost, uh, you know, a double standard. Didn't you ask for a double standard? Uh, no, no, no. <laughs> good. Solid work. Good, good, good. All right, let's go to Seal Beach. You do pretty good holding your altitude, uh, but for some reason, level in your senses uh, seems to be left, making left, which is really interesting. Huh. Good, good work. We like to hold over Seal Beach uh, 16. And because it's uh, making left feels level to you, we actually did a full 360. That's crazy. While you were trying to get us to Seal Beach. But you did good holding altitude. Because I can hear it. Yeah. Yeah, you can't really tell with the, with the bank. Good. Actually, just to make sure it counts my airplane, to get you into a good, uh, unusual attitude. All right. And remember to take your time to recover. Eyes closed? Eyes closed. All right. Get you a little disoriented here. What do you think we're doing right now? Don't, left, don't look. Left and down. Cool. All right, let's recover. Solid work. And much better picking that nose up smoother and not yep. ripping it off the floor. Good job. Good, I'm happy. All right. All right, done with that, Seal Beach. Beach Chef 5 Delta Tango, cleared ILS 30 approach. Third ILS 30 approach, Beach Chef 5 Delta Tango. So we said once we're done with unusual attitudes, what do we do here to oh, get yeah. us direct to Seal Beach? Whoop. So first I'm gonna go no, specifically, I'm talking oh, about getting okay, us to well, Seal Beach. Uh, in my mind, I was saying that... Uh, there we go. Now let's get ourselves on course. Yep. That I was going to identify. 5199er, Julia, John Wayne Tower. 119er, Point Niner. That's right. 119er, Point Niner. Good work. We'll go to 3500. And you could add power. We're climbing. Huh. Here. Interesting. 
look at that. Very interesting. Okay. Okay. Well, attempted. Yeah. And anticipate needing more power than you typically do to keep the numbers closer to what we have been uh, getting just because the density altitude is so high. 375 Delta Tango, continue your descent to set and maintain 3,000 for traffic, 9 o'clock, 6 miles southeast on not talking to them, altitude indicates 3,900. All right, uh, down to 3,000 for 375 Delta Tango, we'll be looking for that traffic. 375 Delta Tango, that traffic's not turning southwest on no factor. Roger. Very nice. Good. You're looking at your VSI there? Yep. Good. Solid. But I was I let go to see what my trim was. And then it ran away from you. Yep. Yep. Because my trim wasn't set. Constant scan, constant scan, constant scan. No, that's it. That's a slice of pizza. Way, that's even too steep. Start turning right a little bit. Good. You never want to f actually fly towards the needle. You want to shallowly intercept it. Is there anything we could do with uh, approach? We could uh, let them know we're going to the hole. Cool. Just give him a heads up. Yep. Approach Cirrus 9 or 6, six Tango Tango. 9 or 9 or 6 Tango Tango go. Uh, we're going to be doing the hold over Seal Beach and then eventually the VOR into Alpha. Into Fuller t four, two, 6 Tango Tango. You can include with that, just want to give nine you a six, heads six, up. Tango Tango in fear position. Uh, about uh, two miles uh, north. East of northwest of uh, Seal Beach. And you're a Cirrus? Cirrus uh, SR22, slant uniform. 966 Tango Tango, squad 0236. 0236, 6 Tango Tango. 6 Tango Tango, maintain 3,500 for traffic. I have another aircraft holding beneath you, a Skyhawk 11 o'clock, 3 miles, maneuvering 3,000. Maintain 3,500, looking for traffic, 6 Tango Tango. Beach at 5, Delta, Tango, Long Beach Tower, 119.4. Switching 5, Delta, Tango. 206 uniform, traffic 11 o'clock, 2 miles southeast, Sanza, Sierra, 3500. Switching to the Sierra, 206 uniform. Sierra 6, Tango, Tango, radar contact over Seal Beach, altimeter 2990, just advising you're ready for your request. We'll advise, 6, Tango, Tango. Traffic, traffic. What altimeter setting did he give us? Uh, shit, I missed it. 2990. Thank okay. you. Altitude, 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 altitude. Uh, 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 Walter. Well, we get traffic below us. No, but it's, you never want to correct that way. Shit. And traffic is inside, you could tell. Traffic inside, 6 Tango Tango. Good. Nine or 6, six Tango Tango, thank you. So I'm trending down. Did you say, say again? No, 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 he said thank you. Oh. So I'm turning it down, heading right into traffic, and it doesn't mean that I shouldn't, uh, you know, do something exceptional to not hit another airplane. No, we were 500 feet, then we were right, four, right, four or three, and I'm going down. I, I would want you to not do that. Right, I want so you to, yeah. 
All right, just be careful with that kind of direction. Uh-huh. That just goes against every hackle in my body. I, I understand, but we weren't... I hear what you're saying. All right, so, I'm, so next time I'm in an emergency situation, I go, oh, no, my instructor told me don't do anything out of the ordinary uh, to not run into somebody. We, let me ask you this. Could we have avoided that traffic by pulling less Gs? Let's put it that way. So if I slowly put back pressure on it, I probably would have been, kept trending down into him. Because uh, I told you altitude when we were about 50 feet away from 35. It wasn't like 32. If it that, if it were that close, I would say yes. All right, I felt like I was avoiding an emergency situation. Cool. So. I totally I totally get that. Totally get that. I don't fault you for thinking that way. I don't think you're wrong. Should be pushing me into the hole. And if you look at that, it actually reminds you that I did a moment ago. 2900. Going 3177 Charlie, so kind of approach. Descend to be a fire at 2000. Descend to 2000, 77 Charlie. Where are we going? Oh, shit. Good. Here's 6 Tango Tango, traffic's 12, moving to Alone o'clock and one mile southbound to Cherokee, restricted 4,000. Looking for traffic, 6 Tango Tango. Traffic, traffic. In sight, no factor. Traffic in sight, no factor, 6 Tango Tango. Right here. Good work. Put, uh, is it 8408 Echo V2 at uh, 1000 phone number going to 1600. 8408 Echo, so Cal Approach, flooding 120, Vector for Allah. Let's 120 for, for maintenance. Keep the standard Echo rate turn coming all the way until we're on the outbound course, because look at where the wind's coming from. Our ground speed's the highest right now. Big radius. Just keep the turn coming. And don't stop until we're headed outbound. Traffic, traffic. Three one seven seven Charlie, right turn heading three zero zero. Right turn heading three zero zero seven seven Charlie. What are you looking at right now? Um, basically, my rate of turn, my altitude, my tracking. Let me try something. Let's do an experiment. 3177 Charlie, Long Beach Airport, 12 o'clock and 6 miles. Long Beach Airport, in sight, 77 Charlie. 77 Charlie, thank you. Make straight in runway 30, contact Long Beach Tower, 119.4. 119.4, straight in, 3-0. I'm going to keep that right there on the pink at zero. Thanks okay. for help. All right, at the incorrect altitude or? At the correct altitude. And then make sure it doesn't go from zero.
I think we just cracked the code on something. What do you think? Uh, Regarding altitude. Well, I've always known to keep that at zero. It's just, it's dynamic, right? It's I can't just hold the, the pitch angle at one place. Right, we're not asking you to. We want you to vary the pitch in order to maintain your VSI, your vertical speed at zero. Right. And that's why I covered your yellow chevron. Because I don't care what your yellow chevron is doing. You see how your altitude is maintained? I guess there's one less thing in my scan. Uh -huh. Tango Alpha, Tango Alpha, SoCal Approach. Roger, report the future turn inbound. Sometimes looking at less things but the right things are the thing to do. That right there simply shows you your traffic. Traffic, traffic. Are you headed up or are you headed down? Traffic, traffic. Traffic, traffic. Damn it. Traffic, traffic. Delta. And who is that calling? Let's go ahead. Your transmission is broken. Solid. Solid as a rock. A four zero echo left. Look at you. Zero three zero. Look at me. Traffic. Traffic. Shut up. Number three four Alpha Delta. So kind of approach. Is that you calling? I uh, know. I haven't checked in yet. We're uh, one thousand climbing two thousand on a two 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 heading. Three four Alpha Delta. So kind of part to your radar contact. Climb maintain three thousand. Climb maintain three thousand for Alpha Delta. So we just learned something. TBM 9010, Papa Kilo, one and two. Are we looking for a constant uh, pitch attitude four, to maintain altitude? Four, yes. Uh, uh, well, not so constant, count? but it's basically. I don't care where you're, no, I don't oh, care oh, where pitch you're. Pitch attitude, so, well, I'm adjusting my pitch attitude to maintain a, a constant speed. Constant altitude. Constant altitude. Good. 910, Papa Kilo, one and two, one heading, settling, I'm talking. 910, Papa Kilo, fly heading of 160, vector for AKA, descent. as power Papa settings Papa change Papa and Papa wind Papa. shifts, and we have less energy or more energy, we need more and less angle of attack to maintain 3,500 feet. Does that make sense? Yep. So I don't care what your pitch attitude is doing. I don't care if, if we entered into slow flight right now and I told you to maintain 35, would you pitch the nose up or down? Uh, if we maintain, if we're in the slow flight, meaning we pull the power out? Uh-huh. Or is there a yeah, kilo pitch up. Exactly, does that make sense? Yeah. But what would this show? Same thing, zero. So this is the constant, not this. That's why I covered that. Right. All I care about is the constant. Zero at echo, left turn heading 310, intercept the localizer. 310 intercept the localizer, zero eight echo. We're four Alpha Delta, right turn heading 320. Right turn 320 for Alpha Delta. See, zero we don't look at the altitude for a second. Left turn heading 130, descend and maintain 3000. Left 130, descend and maintain 3000, zero Papa Kilo. Number zero at echo, you're three miles from Gunny. Maintain 1,600 until established, clear to ILS, 3 zero approach. Zero eight echo, 1,600, clear for the ILS approach. I want to try something with you. My power? Your power. All I want you to do is just keep zero doing what you're doing, maintain 3,500 feet, okay? 4,000 for traffic, I get an aircraft, 12 o'clock, three miles maneuvering, altitude indicates 3,500. Maintain 4,000, zero, pop kilo. Delta, right turn 350. Right turn 350 for Alpha Delta. So, Calvin, 206 uniform, we're ready for the uh, localizer 30 into Long Beach. 6 uniform, right turn heading 120. Right turn 120, 6 uniform. Number 0 Papa Kilo, now to center, maintain. 2,000. Maintain 2,000, zero, Papa Kilo. 
So I'm slowly decreasing your power. What do you think is happening to your pitch attitude? One up. It's going up, right? Do we really care about what the pitch attitude's doing? No. no. Does that make sense? Yes. Good, I want to cement that idea. Good. Less deep, remember, slow flight, slow motion, everything's slow. We're losing altitude because we don't have enough pitch attitude. Zero, zero, there. Five kilo, fighting, zero, nine, zero. Zero, nine, zero, zero, five kilo. Good. Now hold that. Don't increase it. Just hold it. As long as you generate any rate of climb, your climb will go up inevitably. Good. See that? So right now we're pitching way more towards the sky, but we're still looking to maintain a zero rate of climb. Six zero uniform, expedite your descent through 2500, descend and maintain 2000. Descend and maintain 2000. Zero pop kilo, left turn zero three zero. Left zero three zero zero pop kilo. Good, I'm adding a little Six power. Zero uniform, right turn hitting two zero zero. Two zero zero. Eight three four zero Lima, uh, three thousand. Request the VOR, but in two four Number six tango tango. Climb four thousand. Climb four thousand. Six tango tango. Three number eight three four zero Lima Soquel Charger. Zero Papa Kilo fighting three six zero. Fighting three six zero zero Papa Kilo. Number six tango tango. Contact approach one two seven two. One two seven two six tango tango. Alright, eight three four zero. Lima climb to three thousand five hundred. Three thousand five hundred. Four thousand. Approach zero nine or six six tango tango. Uh, four thousand two hundred descending four thousand uh, in the hold over Seal Beach. Zero nine six six tango tango. So kill approach Roger. I'll tell two nine or nine or zero. Two nine or nine or zero six tango tango. Good. You have the power, you have everything. There, 276 Tango Mike, SoCal approach, Roger, descend to maintain 4,000. Number 6 Tango Tango for traffic, climb VFR to 4,500. 4,500, 6 Tango Tango. Number six tango, Mike, and uh, you have information, Lima? Uh, we have Kilo, uh, we can go get Lima. And that's all right, uh, six tango, Mike, John Wayne, Lima, wind 2207, the weather VFR, altimeter 2990. Yeah, 2990, I'll tell you that. Six tango, Mike. Okay, so that's 65710, heading 130, 2900. Number 65710, SoCal approach, Fullerton information, Mike, current, the wind 110, weather VFR. Altimeter 2999 or 2, runway 6 is in use, and uh, they're advertising the VOR Alpha approach. Would you like to straight in or the full procedure turn? Uh, full procedure turn, and if possible, we'd like to uh, cancel and go VFR for a practice for 710. And number 65710, copy cancellation of IFR, maintain VFR, thank you. Maintain VFR, would you like us still at 4,000 for 710? And number 65710, uh, yeah, maintain VFR at 4,000 for traffic and uh, squawk 0237. 0237, 4,000, 710. Number 31 Hotel, traffic no factor, he's inbound, contact Torrance Tower. Torrance Tower, 31 Hotel. 31 Hotel.
So actually, before you go, you got one more piece of traffic coming your way. Two o'clock and about two miles southbound, 2100. Six two three one hotel, contact Tor Star. November six two three one hotel, contact Tor Star. November six Tango Mike and turn left hitting a zero nine or zero. Left zero nine or zero. There's six Tango Mike, good rate all the way down to 4,000, and uh, proceed direct to Seal Beach. Depart Seal Beach, heading 060. Okay, down to 4,000, and then direct Seal Beach, and depart Seal Beach at 040. And uh, six Tango Mike, direct Seal Beach, depart Seal Beach, heading 060, vector is final. Very nice, Walter. Back Seal Beach at 060. Six Tango Mike. I just want to make sure you're going to go to Seal Beach, and then you're going to depart Seal Beach, heading 060. Yes, sir. Direct Seal Beach and Depart Seal Beach at Vector 060. For 6 Tango Mike. Vector 710, you can proceed direct to Seal Beach. Direct Seal Beach 710. Okay, I'll flint 36 via my request. What can a long way you've come, Walter. Yeah, just gotta keep doing Flint's, it, doing uh, it, doing 36, it. 336, are you on a company code? Affirmative, I'm going to for you. Uh, we'd like to pick up the... Alright, uh, so let's try and get ATIS. Uh, Let's transition to autopilot. Okay. Flint 36, IDEN. So we're going to go IDEN, Flint 36, we'd like to pick up the coastal route GPS northbound 6,500. And that looks good. Flint 36, let's set, 40, uh, let's set 4,500 feet on the ceiling. Total departure is Kahaki 40 at 19 hundred. No, solid work. Tanks are off. Good publish hold. Yeah, this is on because we've been banking and stuff. So. Good work.